Hello, darlings. You've all heard of Marilyn Monroe. Some of you know Bridget Fardo. Well, now it's time for the cognac show. I said cognac. Ooh, ooh. I said cognac. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm your fancy blonde, fabulously dressed. Welcome back. I'm Cognac Willow Lane, and we're here on the Upper East Side at Hummus 21 at this fabulous Mediterranean, kosher Mediterranean restaurant. And I'm here with the owner, Zach, and he's going to talk about these wonderful dishes that we are seeing right here on the table uh, for this beautiful dinner that we're going to have. And it's all happening during New York Fashion Week. But we had to take a break from our busy schedules at Lincoln Center to talk about the wonderful cuisine in this fabulous restaurant. So, Zach, tell my audience about this, all these wonderful dishes that we're looking at right here. Start with this one right over here. That looks amazing. All right. Thank you for having me. And uh, we welcome our guest. This is uh, Hummus. Our name of the restaurant is Hummus, so we thought we should do something that reflects our name. Uh, hummus is made every made to order so it's nothing nothing left over not it's whenever order gets in chef makes it uh, so it's fresh it's, daily it's made to order so you can imagine maybe 10 minutes before it was chickpeas wow <laughs> so uh, our tahini is tahini is the best part of uh, of uh, hummus good tahini makes a good hummus our tahini is imported from uh, israel mm -hmm. uh, our chickpeas are imported from morocco and they are soaked over uh, two nights, two days actually, to uh, soak so that they are not canned, nothing like that. They are very nice um, with uh, some drizzles of, uh, of uh, parsley. Now this is a dish, of course, it's hummus and the restaurant is called Hummus 21. So this is one of the very popular signature dishes here at the restaurant. Am I right about that? It is. It is. Just because the name, guests wants to try it. Okay, just because the name, I want to I want to taste the hummus and so far nobody has said anything about hummus just because it's fresh and it's just and it's, it's a healthy choice. It's just wonderful. It's absolutely wonderful, right? Yes, it is absolutely. Now wonderful. tell my audience about this dish. This looks this very colorful and very delicious All looking. Right. So this is called a uh, very simple, very healthy. It's called Moroccan carrots uh, with chef special uh, spices. Chef doesn't want to reveal it, I guess. <laughs> Maybe uh, he just want to keep a secret. But it's very healthy. Um, it's uh, a grill first so that it gets the smoky flavor and then um, it's cooked. Um, chopped and uh, with some uh, parsley. As you know, parsley and mint, it's all about Mediterranean uh, fresh spices. 
Now this dish looks very vegetarian. What is that all about? It is vegetarian. Um, it yeah. is called bureka, uh with tahini sauce. Uh, we have a potato bureka and a mushroom bureka. They're all more. They're more like puff pastries, but they're all made in house every day. We make it fresh, with garnished with some uh, cucumbers and fresh carrots. Wonderful. And it is vegetarian, vegan, so nothing to worry about. And on the end over there, that looks beautiful. It looks like tomatoes and tomatoes perhaps and beans, eggplant. 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 Is that what that is? It is tomatoes and eggplants. Eggplants are again grilled for the smoky, the smoky flavor, and uh, and it's just tomato paste with some uh, cherry tomatoes. I love this dish. This right. looks That's, wonderful. It is the I would say the healthiest salad you can have. You can have it with any sorts of protein you would like. It's called the chopped salad. Uh, it's also called Israeli salad. I guess it's uh, it started from uh, Israel or that part, uh, that Mediterranean part of the world. So it's very simple. It's tomatoes, cucumber, mint, parsley, and uh, and chef special uh, lemon vinaigrette. So it's very very fresh. It's uh, very aromatic, also acidic. It's very it's supposed to be very healthy. It's just right for the patrons that want to dine on kosher yes. Mediterranean food and that is the theme here at the restaurant kosher Mediterranean which is very different from a lot of restaurants in New York that you pay homage to being uh, absolutely kosher right. now what made you come up with that concept of kosher um, we are in we're located in Midtown East 57 and first this area demands a kosher restaurant. We have the, we have done a extensive survey. What kind of restaurant this area demands, and what kind of a patron lives in this area, and uh, we came. And this is the answer. We need a kosher restaurant, really nice kosher restaurant in this area. And since it's very high end, and 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 it's a demand for kosher, we have a little bit of everything else, but no kosher. Now, how long have you been here at this location? This, this location we recently opened. It's been three months only. Only three only months. Three months. Where were you ever? Did you own any other restaurants in the uh, in New uh, York not area? In, not in the uh, U.S. Me, uh, me and my partner, we had a breast business in the U.K., but not in New York. Oh, in the United Kingdom, yes. Britain. Oh, very nice. What's the name of that restaurant? Also, Homeless Twenty One. No, it's it's Indian restaurant. It's it uh, nothing to do with Mediterranean food, but it was uh, spices has to do with spices. So we are more into spices and and authentic spices. Terrific. Now. For an entree, uh, this is all splendid. But for an entree, what do your patrons like to eat? What are the sig what is the signature dish here at the restaurant? When everyone from New York, all over the world, where, in Manhattan, where do they want? What do they want to eat when they come here to dine at Hummus Twenty One? Um, since it's uh, it's kosher, everybody it's more healthier sides. No dairy, obviously. No dairy is here. No dairy, no meat. No, we yes, we have uh, we are glad kosher meat. Okay. So no dairy, um, and and we signature dish would be um, our shish kebab. Kebabs are really nice. We have a kebab made with lamb. We have beef, but uh, more about vegetables. We our guests they uh, they are more healthy diners, so they require more veggies, more fish. We have a much more healthy much diet. Much more healthier diet, yes. And for dessert, what to tell my audience? What people? What do people like to order here for dessert? Um, Mediterranean first thing comes into mind bakalava, it's made in house, and uh, I would say the Oprah cake. And also, what's your favorite dish here at the restaurant? You must the, have a favorite dish that you just love to eat here. Uh, if you say a dessert, I would say the uh, molten lava cake, since it's a challenge uh, when you don't have dairy on a cake to keep the consistency, and uh, we're able Maybe to. Maybe I should it. try that. Definitely, definitely, and we would like you to try okay. it. And the dinner, what do you recommend? What should we eat? What should we dine on here tonight at Hummus 21? Um, what is your appetite telling? Are you, are you, would you like to eat? I like seafood. Seafood? I love seafood. Sure. We have uh, salmon. Uh, we have Ooh, delicious. Salmon. Yes, and they're in skewers. They're called salmon brochette. They come in a skewer. So uh, Bring that. And it's grilled, so it's even better. Even better, grilled and fresh. Grilled and fresh. That's what Manhattanites like, grilled, fresh, authentic okay. kosher food and this is what they serve here at hummus 21 and i want you to tell my audience where we can go to find out more information what is the website all right so it's called hummus 21.com uh, we all we are also uh we're located in, in 1055 first avenue on corner of 57th street 
and uh, we all welcome you to. Uh, we want you to see. We would you like to see you? Yes, and Facebook. Are you on Facebook we as well? We are on Facebook. We are on Instagram. We are on Twitter. So uh, all hummus twenty. Hummus twenty one. Yes. Hummus twenty one. Let's have a drink. Let's just toast a drink. All right. You want to take the wine? Oh, okay. And we'll just toast. All right. Cheers. For a wonderful dinner. Thank you so much for the wonderful dinner. My pleasure. Thanks. And we'll be back in a moment, darlings. More interviews coming up. Keep watching. <laughs> Pink champagne kisses. It's been a Cry Baby Productions, darlings.